Bring your lead pipeline to the next level by connecting Hayflow with HubSpot. In this video, we'll show you how you can track new responses as contacts, deals, or companies in your favorite CRM. Let's get started. With our HubSpot integration, you can map Hayflow fields to HubSpot fields to easily send information from your Hayflow to your CRM and track new submits as contacts, deals, or companies. Before we can start mapping Hayflow fields to HubSpot fields, we need to set system labels for all relevant blocks. For this, head back to build mode and select an input block. Scroll down to the system tab and give your block a descriptive system label. To learn more about system labels, check the video suggestion above or head to our help center. After you have set up your system labels, you can now start setting up the HubSpot integration. First, Head to the Integrations tab. You'll find HubSpot under Response Handlers. Click on Connect to HubSpot and a pop-up window will open. After you have logged in with your HubSpot credentials, you will be asked to confirm the account you would like to connect to. Once the authentication is completed, you can select how new responses should be recorded in HubSpot. You can choose between Contacts, Deals and Companies. Let's start with Contacts. We can map all relevant Hayflow fields to their respective HubSpot counterpart. All fields that are not mapped will later appear in the Message tab in HubSpot. Once you've mapped all relevant fields, click on Save Changes. Now let's click through this example flow to see how our responses will be handled. When we switch over to HubSpot, we can now see that a new contact has been created and all relevant information has been added. As mentioned before, the data that wasn't mapped can be found in the Message tab. The setup process for deals is the same, just the fields will differ based on your HubSpot setup and custom fields. After we mapped our required fields and saved our changes, we can now have a look at how a submit from the same Hayflow would look like as a deal in HubSpot. Unlike for contacts, Unmapped information will not be transferred for deals and companies, so make sure you map all relevant fields that you want to see in HubSpot later on. Lastly, we can track new submits as companies. As before, map all applicable fields before saving your changes. Once your Hayflow visitor hits the Submit button, the new company will immediately appear in HubSpot. Congratulations! Now you know how to connect your Hayflow with HubSpot to boost your lead pipeline. Check out our other tutorial videos or the Help Center to become a Hayflow expert. Happy building and have a great day!